So for everyone, uh, here we are going through goalie loadouts for NHL 25. Now this one got given to me from a pro esports player, esports goalie, Cash from Aspire Dragons. Very good goalie and uh, he was kind enough to uh, share his build with me. Been trying it out and it's been working wonders for me in threes and sixes. So here's the build. You're going to be a hybrid goalie. Your height is going to be 196 centimeters, or if you've got it changed around, it's six foot five, 86.1 kilograms, or 190 pounds. Catching glove, whichever one you guys like to use, catch left or right, it doesn't really matter. Now, you're going to go gold. Butterfly. This is quite broken this year. But then so is gold post to post, but for this specific build you need gold butterfly. So silver post to post, this is really going to help you get across the goal. Now this year it is an absolute must. You are going to need one timer because the one tees that players are doing this year in 25 are absolutely ridiculous. So you're going to need one timer in this build. It helps massively with one timers as long as you can track it properly and position yourself nine times out of ten, you're stopping that one T. So no timer is a must. Your boosts, you need a quick recovery for any rebounds, because rebounds are ridiculous and we all know how slow goalies can get up, especially from 24. Not so much 23, but 24, yes, they were extremely slow at getting up. And glove vision for this will help you stop uh, one timers either side. Um, if you're screened for a tip, this will uh, give you a bit of a give you a bit of a boost trying to track down the puck. Now, attributes. You're going to need 89 glove low, 89 stick low, and your five hole, put it down to minus three. Now, these attributes don't matter what numbers you've got because your butterfly effect will kick in as soon as you drop down. You're going to be low enough anyway. So put these settings down to 89, 89, 83 hands. You want plus one glove high for the one tees. So I've set that to 90, stick high, again for one T is a blocker side, whichever side that may be for you, at 90. You're passing, it's not a big issue. Uh, put it down to 84. Now your speed, you're going to need to be quick this year. The uh, puck handling for players this year is absolutely insane. So speed, you're going to want that at 92, so plus three, agility. At 93, so plus four. Don't worry about poke checking. Poke checking's all to do with timing and luck. So put that down to 85. Your durability is not an issue. You've got a health bar after two saves. You're practically dead anyway. You're in the you're in the red. So put that down to 85. Same with endurance. Same things. Durability after two saves. Your health bar's gone down to red anyway. So the quicker your defence can pick it up and get it out, the quicker you'll recharge. Now positioning. This is this build is all to do with positioning as well for all these attributes to work. So rebound control, put to 80, minus six. Your vision, you are gonna need a lot of vision for this build, especially for this year as well. So put that up to 94. Breakaways, we all know how quick players can be, especially with the stick hand in this year. Put that to 94. Your angles, if you can set your angles right and your positioning right, it's not too much of an issue because, again, your abilities will help you cover that and if you can position yourself right. And recovery, you're going to need a very quick recovery. This is a recovery build. Also, it's, it's both. It's a recovery and a positional build. So put your recovery to 96. Um, your stance... 
which would help you massively. It's quite a wide stance and it keeps you very low and your play or your goalie will get lower as the puck comes more towards your crease. So if you go with stance 50, you won't need to move across the net as much to cover your posts because your goalie have a bit of a wider stance. So give it a go. Let me know what you think in the comments. And uh, yeah, that's the build. Thank you very much, guys. Any more builds that you guys can think of or you want me to try out or you want my opinion on, leave a comment and I will get back to you as soon as I can. But enjoy. Try this build out. Let me know what you think. Thanks, guys. See you later.